Hey YouTube, it's ICU, you, and today we have something very important to discuss in the realm of jailbreaking, particularly related to the next untethered jailbreak for iOS 9.2 and possibly 9.2.1. It appears as though one of Taiji's associates may have confirmed their plans to release a brand new jailbreak. <laughs> All right, so getting started, be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up for this incredible news and stick around to the end for instructions on how to enter my fourth gen Apple TV giveaway. With that said, let's get into this. What exactly are we talking about? So as I mentioned, one of Taiji's known associates, in this case being 3K Assistant, may have confirmed the group's plans to release a brand new jailbreak. So I'm just on Taiji's official website right now, and 3K Assistant is clearly featured. They're one of the ones who helped provide funding for the creation of their iOS 8.1.x and 8.3 through up to 8.4 jailbreak utilities. So they definitely share a link to Taiji that simply cannot be argued with. Now, what's interesting is that the group 3K Assistant was actually quoted saying this little bit right here, which I'll get into in just a second. But first, let's back up a little bit. Now, 3K Assistant today actually posted on their Weibo account, which is a form of Chinese microblogging, and they reiterated that intel and quote, which was posted on the 18th. However, they sense have taken down their post reiterating it. This was the direct link to it. It's again just on Weibo's website and it provides a 404 or page not found error. So we can go ahead and switch on over here. This is Weibo's official account. You'll notice that when we actually look at the image, you can see that they are verified. This is 3K Assistant's Weibo and the last post on their account was on the 18th talking about 3K Assistant version 2.4.1. Remember they did post today. However, it has since been taken down and that's likely because Taiji, the group behind the creation of the jailbreaks, told them to do so. Remember, jailbreak developers never give ETAs or status updates, and the only reason that we have the info we're discussing in today's video is simply because it's from one of Taiji's associates. So now we can return to this original quote here, and we can quickly grab it and bring it over into Google Translate. So I'm just going to copy these first two paragraphs, which again are in Chinese, and once we do copy them, again, we can head on over over to translate.google.com and we can paste it in to translate it. So down below we have the English version which states quote iOS 9.2 official version has been released from the past eight days and in eight days the escape big god who have been in hard struggle for the iOS 9.2 jailbreak. The effort is rewarding after eight days of struggle escape big god seems to have been a breakthrough. Although still not completely escape iOS 9.2 but I believe that in the near future. iOS 9.2 jailbreak will appear in everyone's eyes. Please inmates, patiently looking forward to it. So what the heck does that mean? Because this doesn't translate very well from Chinese to English. It essentially means that eight days after iOS 9.2's release, which again was on December 8th, significant progress has been made toward the creation of an iOS 9.2 jailbreak, though it's not fully complete and additional testing and finalization is undoubtedly required. Remember, Remember, eight days from December 8th would have been December 16th though. So this is currently December 20th and this bit was also posted and confirmed on 3K Assistance Weibo today before they took it down, again likely by Taiji's orders. So this is some astonishing news for everyone who's stuck without a jailbreak on iOS 9.1 or the current public firmware being 9.2. Now, since iOS 9.2.1 was thrown into the mix, we don't exactly know how that will affect the creation or the release of the next untethered jailbreak, especially since we don't have any semblance of an ETA. What we have from 3K Assistant merely confirms that Taiji is not only working on a new jailbreak for iOS 9.2, but that they've made significant strides in doing so. And for those of you who are wondering if we're going to receive a jailbreak before the holidays, if Taiji decides to target iOS 9.2.1, it might not happen because Apple delayed all software releases for the week of Thanksgiving, which they'll likely do this week, seeing as Christmas does fall on Friday here in the US. So if this jailbreak is contingent upon iOS 9.2.1, again, we might not receive it before Christmas, though we'll just have to wait and see. The good news here is that Taiji is working on a new solution 
resolution. Again, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. This is some absolutely great news. And for those of you who want to win a brand new fourth gen Apple TV, all you have to do is just navigate to freeappsfast.com inside of Mobile Safari and sign up. Once you do, download sponsored apps for points just so long as you earn points and then post your referral code in my unboxing of the fourth gen Apple TV. I'll have a link for you guys on your screens now. Also, if you want additional information on iOS 9.2 in general, as well as some other jailbreak updates surrounding the firmware, then I'll have some links for you guys on your screens now in the form of annotations as well as cards. Just be sure to refer to them for everything you need and to be updated more often, such as when I release new videos and jailbreak updates similar to this one, or even my untethered jailbreak tutorial once a new utility is released. Click the subscribe button below next to my channel name, like me on Facebook, and follow me on Twitter. Remember guys, each day that passes, we're getting closer to the release of a new jailbreak. And until next time, this is ICU signing out. <laughs>